In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix any lagging issues you're having in Roblox and how to get the maximum performance out of your laptop. So before changing any computer settings, you first need to head over to the Roblox application and then click on the settings icon in the top left hand side. From the top, click on settings and then you need to scroll down until you see graphics mode. Now you need to change this from automatic to manual and then you need to reduce the graphics quality all the way down to one bar. Now if I click on resume, you can see obviously the graphics quality has worsened but it's actually improved massively the performance of my game so all you need to do here is come back over to the settings and you need to find a healthy balance between quality and performance on my particular model of laptop i find that three bars works best for me and that kind of gives me a good balance between both visuals and performance in the game once you've adjusted the settings in roblox you can close out of the application and the next thing we're going to do is head over to the start menu on your computer and search for task manager Click on the task manager window and you just want to close down any background applications that may be running on your computer. Anything like internet browsers, for example, like Google Chrome, you can close this down and just basically anything that you're not currently using, you want to make sure it's closed down. You can do this just by right clicking on the application and selecting end task. Make sure to only close down applications that you're sure you know what they are. You don't want to end up closing down an important Windows service. Then you can close out of this window and the next thing we're going to do is head over to the start menu and search for settings and click on the settings window from the left hand side click gaming select game mode and make sure you have this turned on this is also going to apply some automatic optimizations for gaming then you need to click system from the left hand side click on display scroll down to graphics and select this from your list of applications here find roblox and select it click on options and make sure you have high performance selected and press save you can then close out of this window you can then head over to the the start menu and search for adjust the appearance and then click on this link here now in the visual effects tab you want to either choose adjust for best performance or you can select custom and copy the settings i have on the screen so basically that means you want to leave everything here unchecked apart from animations in the taskbar enable peak show thumbnails instead of icons and smooth edges of screen fonts everything else leave it unchecked and press apply and okay and then finally we're going to head back over to the start menu and search for run and click on the run icon in this box you're just going to type in the word temp and hit enter then what you need to do is delete all of these temporary files don't worry it's nothing important it's completely safe to delete all of these so you're just going to press Control a on your keyboard to select everything right click and then select the trash icon to delete it if you get this message pop up select do this for all current items and press continue there may be some files or folders left over that can't be deleted it's absolutely fine close out of this window and then head back over to the start menu and search for run once again this time we're going to type in percentage sign temp percentage sign and hit enter and once again select everything inside of this folder right click press the trash icon to delete it and press continue click do this for all current items and press try again and just like before if there are some files and folders that can't be deleted it's absolutely fine close out of this window and lastly you're going to head over to the recycle bin on your computer and select empty recycle bin and click yes once you've finished all of these steps you can try restarting your computer and that should have solved any lagging issues you were getting in roblox if you did find this video helpful then let me know in the comments below and i'll see you in the next one